Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, I get to go in a truck ride. I'm going out west with my good friend Dennis here. We're got a situation going on out there that we got to try and solve. So out west we're headed. Got our miserable cold day. Good snowy day. A good snowy day. Yeah. And uh, see if we can make her in. We're headed up yeah. to the hummingbird. So stay tuned. It's going to be snowing. We're not going to be able to see anything in the mountains, but I'll give you pictures anyway. It's still going to be a good day. It's still going to be a good day. <laughs> stay tuned. Ah, here we go, Falls Creek Road. What do you think, Dennis? Are they going to open it back up for us? Hope so. It's a neat place. Dennis there, he's doing a good job of driving. He's got the tough jobs. I'm navigating, but old farm truck here. Farm truck knows the way. Yeah. Weather's well, a little better. Keep the bridges between the ditches. Ah, here we go down into the Ram River. This is a neat place. There's big ass waterfalls all through these canyons. Yeah, I've been here in a while. Cool. We are at the Hummingbird. Hummingbird Forest Recreation. Friends of the Eastern Slopes, invasive plants, ATV users, Heritage ATV Society, Onion Creek Road Corridor. Look at all the stuff going on here. They got speed limits. Well, unfortunately, our trip has come to an end. The greeter only went this far, and we are, uh, we're gonna let fear and common sense get in our way, and we're not gonna carry on. So we didn't get to go down there, and we had a little situation we needed to look at. And uh, the boss in the truck here says, our day is done. <laughs> <laughs> OK, homeward bound. The boss says we're going to go for it. Yeehaw. Well, the brief guys we are, we we got stuck out there in the middle. It's a little bit of shoe shoveling and we got her done. So we're here, we've got to look at some trail here and uh, kind of in a cross between summer and winter. Got early snow, some rutting. Just gonna be checking it out. Got Dennis here with David Thompson Snow Riders and the Heritage ATV Society. Doing the stewardship work and all that. Kudos to our stewards, man. Quality people and just having them out there. This guy has been around for years. <laughs> He's a chronic. He's worse than me. So let's go check out, see what we've got to deal with. We're in uh, the Bighorn back country. This is one of our public land use zones. We have time trails and all that. We had early snow this year, so some of the quads and that. Kind of got in, did some running up, some say. This is way up in Ranger Creek. I've never been here. Snowmobile country. I've been here in the winter. I've been lots and lots of trail work. Up in the Hummingbird and the Canary and that sort of stuff. Great country. Okay. Nice hike up the mountain. What did we come up? The Ram and the Hummingbird and Ranger Creek here somehow. So mission accomplished. We have checked out the trail. There is some running here, no big deal in our view. Wish I had trails this good to ride on. <laughs> but we have come, we have looked. Downhill's easier. <laughs> Well, we are almost back to town. It was a, it was a short trip. 
did some four wheel driving, got stuck, hiked up on the mountain. Yeah, got the trail inspection done. Trail inspection, checked it out, and indeed, there's snow out there. Yep. <laughs> so, you guys, there's a bunch of clubs around in here. Dennis is with the David Thompson Snow Riders, Snow Dutchess, Snow Riders, Snow Riders, and the Heritage ATV Society. There's all sorts of clubs that are out working around trying to keep trails open for everybody so you make sure that you get a hold of them find out if you can help but most importantly thank these folks when you're on the trail nobody's making money doing this it's all volunteer type stuff and we're just trying to keep the trails open kind of chronics in that regard so until next time yeah we're working on the trails, so make sure you like, subscribe, and help these guys out. Help our volunteers out. So we'll see you next time. Ciao for now.